In a remarkable display of military prowess, the skies above Zhuhai are set to host an unprecedented showcase featuring the Russian Su-57 fighter jet, the Chinese J-15 and the stealthy J-35A. On November 5, 2024, Colonel Niu Wenbo of the Air Force Equipment Department confirmed that China's latest medium-sized stealth multi-purpose fighter, the J-35A, will be showcased at the 15th China Air Show, scheduled for November 12-17, 2024. Following the press conference, an official photo of the J-35A was released, marking its first public unveiling and signaling its readiness for operational service within the People's Liberation Army Air Force. The development of the J-35A traces back to the J-31 Jerfalcon, a project initiated by Shenyang Aircraft Corporation and the Aviation Industry Corporation of China as a self-funded export-oriented model. The J-31 prototype first appeared in 2012 generating considerable interest. This year's Zhuhai Air Show, held in Guangdong Province, South China, has captured the keen interest of Chinese media which highlights the significance of these three aircraft as they take center stage. These aircraft do more than just exhibit advancements in aviation technology, they unveil the strategic aspirations of both Russia and China within the complex landscape of modern military geopolitics. The skies above Zhuhai are set to host an unprecedented showcase featuring the Russian Su-57 fighter jet, the Chinese J-15 and the stealthy J-35A. A Russian military aircraft is making an appearance at an airshow in China provoking questions about its supposed advanced abilities. The Su-57, also known by its NATO reporting name Felon, is appearing at the 15th China International Aviation and Aerospace Exhibition. After Russia landed its stealthy Su-57 fighter in China for the Zhuhai airshow, it has now intensified its promotional efforts, highlighting the jet's effectiveness in countering Western air defense systems, particularly the US-made Patriots. The Su-57, a fifth-generation fighter jet, boasts a range of innovative features, including stealth capabilities, exceptional maneuverability, and cutting-edge combat management systems. With its twin-engine design and versatility in mission profiles, the Su-57 is engineered to engage in various combat scenarios. Its extraordinary supermaneuverability makes it a formidable contender in close air combat situations. And its primary operational roles encompass air superiority, close air support for ground operations, and strategic reconnaissance. In real-world conflicts, the Su-57 is poised to operate both independently and in coordination with platforms like the J-15 and J-35A, enabling it to tackle complex military missions. Designed with a focus on radar evasion, the Su-57 gains a significant edge in combat conditions. Its debut at the Zhuhai Air Show underscores the growing military technical cooperation between Russia and China, serving as an emblem of Russia's ambitions to assert influence in Asia. The J-15, often referred to as the Flying Shark, is a heavy carrier-based fighter that serves as a principal combat platform for China's aircraft carriers. With a design inspired by the Russian Su-33, the J-15 is equipped with a robust radar system and the capability to carry a diverse array of munitions, including air-to-air -air and air-to-ground missiles. Its ability to operate from aircraft carrier decks is strategically significant for China's expanding naval ambitions, particularly in the contested waters of the South China Sea. The J-15 not only bolsters the fleet's air defense, but also acts as a means of power projection, underscoring China's determination to dominate the region. Meanwhile, the J-35A is a stealth fighter tailored for radar evasion and maximum agility. Designed for carrier operations, the J-35A is intended to meet the needs of the Chinese Navy and complement the J-15. Equipped with advanced radar and electronic warfare systems, it is capable of executing intricate combat missions and coordinating with other platforms. The J-35A's primary advantage lies in its ability to penetrate hostile territory while minimizing the risk of detection. Its operational scenarios could involve reconnaissance of enemy positions, assaults on hostile vessels, and support for ground forces, particularly in maritime operations. Over time, the J-31 underwent multiple design changes, including forward-swept intake ramps, DSI bumps, and oblique vertical stabilizers, aiming to create a competitive fighter for the global market. Initially targeted for export, the model eventually attracted attention from the PLA, particularly the People's Liberation Army Navy, 
which evaluated a carrier-capable version under the designation J-35. The naval variant completed its maiden flight on October 29, 2021, featuring modifications like a launch bar and folding wings for carrier operations. The participation of the J-35A at the Zhuhai Air Show marks a pivotal moment for China. Showcasing its commitment to the development of contemporary military technology and its capacity to compete with other global powers. The presence of these advanced fighter jets has not gone unnoticed by the international community. The increasing prevalence of Chinese and Russian military platforms in Asia presents new challenges for the United States and its allies, who are closely monitoring the evolving dynamics. Public and military sentiment in China regarding these aircraft is overwhelmingly positive, with many viewing them as symbols of national strength and technological advancement. The involvement of the Su-57, J-15 and J-35A in the Zhuhai Air Show not only highlights technological innovations, but also reflects China's ambition to be a leader in military aviation. The Chinese media's interest in this event indicates a national desire to showcase its achievements and solidify its status as a global military power. The technologies integrated into these new fighter jets represent significant advancements. For instance, the Su-57 incorporates innovations in flight control systems, new materials designed to reduce radar visibility, and sophisticated electronic systems, rendering it difficult to detect and track. The J-35A offers similar technologies but with a focus on naval operations, while the J-15 is specifically designed to meet the challenges of combat at sea. In light of new military doctrines, it is anticipated that the Su-57, J-15, and J-35A will play pivotal roles in the strategic plans of both Russia and China. How these aircraft fit into evolving concepts of warfare will be critical in shaping the future of military airspace in the region and will influence interactions between global military powers. Military analyst Li Li, quoted by China Central Television News, states that the J-35A's induction marks an expansion in the PLA Air Force's stealth capabilities, positioning it alongside the J-20. This step could align PLA Air Force's capabilities with the U.S. Air Force, which operates the F-22 and F-35 stealth fighters. Within the PLA Air Force, the J-35A joins an informal fleet lineup known as the Four Musketeers, comprising the J-10CJ-16 J-20 and the new J-35A. Notably, this reveal coincides with the 75th anniversary celebrations of the PLA Air Force, during which the Air Force will feature 36 different types of equipment through flight demonstrations and static displays.